Welcome to the Hong Kong University of Science and Technology. We are about to embark on a one-of-a-kind campus tour from high above. As a young university, innovation and entrepreneurship are in our DNA. Frank Wang, the founder and CEO of DJI, is a true embodiment of the HKUST spirit. After completing his final thesis on flight control system for unmanned platforms at HKUST, Frank founded DJI in 2006, which has grown into the world's biggest drone manufacturer. You are about to see footage shot with DJI Mavic 2 Pro. Let's sit back and enjoy the extraordinary journey. We begin our tour at the entrance piazza. The piazza is near the North Gate bus stop, minibus stop and taxi stand, with transport to Chen Kuan O, Sai Kong and beyond. The student lounge, indoor sports hall, arts hall, visitor information center, souvenir shop, cafe, bookstore, banks and clinics are also located at the piazza. This is Circle of Time, Red Bird. The sculpture was created by an Australian husband-wife duo. Measuring at 8.5 meter tall, one can tell the time by reading the shadow during daytime. Since its assembly in October 1991, the sculpture has become a landmark of HKUST. It is nicknamed Firebird. Not only is it a landmark, but a few student communities are also named after the sculpture, such as the Red Bird Leadership Community. The leadership aims to nurture students with leadership skills and teach them how to organize activities, making a positive impact on a personal level and to the society. We have reached the staff quarters. There are over 680 faculty and teaching staff at HKUST. All of our professors hold PhD degrees. The library is on the right, rising 5 levels tall. It measures over 12,000 square meters. Its collection holds over 700,000 publications. It houses over 3,300 seats. Last year, over 1.9 million people visited the library. The library has a lot of outdoor areas, including the library garden and balconies. Glass curtain walls spread across all floors, allowing the occupants to enjoy the spectacular view of Clearwater Bay. The LG7 canteen sits at the bottom of the library. There are 19 food outlets on campus. We can savor many different cuisines, such as Western fast food, Chinese barbecue, rice noodles, salad, and pizza, etc. You are looking at the One Word Fountain, created in 2001 by an Austrian sculptor. The sculpture's name is inspired by Heaven is One, Earth is Two from I Ching, Book of Changes. The five stones symbolize five continents. The centerpiece represents Asia, especially China and Hong Kong. Among the 350 young universities with less than 50 years of history, HKUST ranked first in the world in 2018 and 19. Our student body is the most diverse in Hong Kong. We have over 15,000 students, 5,900 are non-local students, coming from over 80 countries and territories. We are now looking at the bridge link. HKUST is built on a hillside. A cluster of academic facilities occupies the top, while student halls are located at the bottom. The bridge link connects the upper and lower campus, forming an essential corridor for students going to and from classes. There are currently 10 undergraduate halls, 9 on campus and 1 in Chen Kuan O. You must have questions about student accommodation. In their first year of study, local students can stay at university-provided accommodation for at least one semester, while non-local students are provided with accommodation in their first two years of study. Everyone has a chance to experience hall life. 
you may want to work out during your stay at a hall. There are of course plenty of sports facilities at HKUST. At Fok Ying Tong Sports Center, it has a standard size soccer pitch and 400 meter athletic track. We also have a 50 meter outdoor swimming pool and a 25 meter indoor pool. There are many tennis courts too. Coming into view is a path, dubbed as Lover's Lane. It is a shortcut between Lo Ka Chung University Center and Academic Building. Tall trees line the lane. It is a popular check-in attraction. Speaking of interesting places, we must mention the Resonance Bridge. Resonance? Physics students may ask. It is a suspension bridge. When a group of students jump on the bridge, the bridge vibrates, hence the name of the bridge. Spanning 60 hectares, HKUST is three times bigger than the Victoria Park. HKUST consists of four schools, namely the School of Science, School of Engineering, School of Business and Management, School of Humanities and Social Science, and the Interdisciplinary Programs Office offering 44 undergraduate degree programs. Let's head to the highest point of campus. The Li Sha Ki campus opened in 2013. It locates near the South Gate and situates next to the now defunct TV city. It is home to the Business Building, Institute of Advanced Study and Conference Lodge. The Li Sha Ki Business Building is seven stories tall. It houses lecture theatres, classrooms, multi-purpose meeting rooms, and seminar facilities. There is a sky garden on the 7th floor rooftop. This is the Institute of Advanced Study IAS. You can see a circular skylight at the top of a 5-storey building. IAS is an academic and research platform for world-leading scientists and scholars. There are many world-renowned professors and visiting professors at IAS, including five Nobel laureates. Apart from academics, students can enjoy a lot of learning opportunities, such as overseas exchange. HKUST offers over 240 exchange programs for students to apply, enabling them to experience different cultures and becoming true global citizens. Regarding future developments at HKUST, the construction of the Global Graduate Tower is well underway on the Li Shao Ki campus. Near the South Gate, the Shaw Auditorium is expected to complete in 2021. There are plans for new students' residence and the innovative tower too. We're almost at the end of our journey. HKUST is one of the most beautiful university campuses in the world. Before we end this drone tour, let's show you the spectacular view of Clearwater Bay. If you want to live out your dream and study in this picturesque campus, please join the world's top young university and study with us. If you have questions about HKUST, please email or message us. Follow us on Instagram, Snapchat, YouTube and Facebook and get the latest news from HKUST.